to these United States. Ew! Oh my god! Along. Long time no see, am I right? Yo, what's up everybody? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Mello. I had to do that for the classic, you feel me? This is a movie that a lot of people have been asking me to do for two years. I checked out the first Hot Shots movie like two and a half years ago. It's crazy how long it's been since we've been watching movies together. And I just want to say I thank all y'all. I can't wait to see what other movies that y'all request for me. You know, you can put that down in the comments or message me on Instagram if you actually want me to see it or follow me on my Patreon. At the time that I was checking out the first one, I was watching a specific kind of comedies that Hot Shots really fell in. You know, when I checked out Hot Shots, I was very excited and I had high expectations because a lot of those movies, I was dying laughing. I watched it, it wasn't as good as a lot of those other comedies to me. I said what I said. Okay, well what okay. you said was some bull but you don't what like it is. I hope that this movie is gonna be better than the first one. You know, I've been checking out a lot of comedies where the sequels have been better than the original. To me, I would say Grown Ups 2 is the sole reason why I wanted to go ahead and check this movie out. Let's go ahead and get into Hot Shots Part 2, everybody. Let's get it. Mm, I like the intro to that song right there. I knew that they was gonna have a spelling error It'd come up, bro. <laughs> Sometimes it is hard to spell assassinate. In the bini, in the bininging. <laughs> That's hilarious. <laughs> you gotta live a more positive life, bro. Why are you doing executions? Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ew, bro. <laughs> Why is he humming that song, though? <laughs> Hot Shots Part 2 brought to you by Brinks. I'm trying to see if I can catch a lot of stuff in this movie. I know it's going to be a lot of me talking, but I know a lot of y'all want me to catch this stuff. Mm-hmm. You already knew that's what was gonna happen. <laughs> that dude got that thin dick. This dude sleeps with a hat on. <laughs> I thought he was gonna sleep peacefully through that. Is anybody even hitting anybody? Oh my God. Ah, I feel like I've seen this before. I wonder if Family Guy did something similar to this. The president is putting on his best political face, continuing on his campaign schedule. Vince oh, he came back. That's what's up. Has plummeted since the hostage crisis began. The CNN <laughs> <laughs> this afternoon, Benson made a brief stop in Fergus Falls, Virginia. That boy got that Kanye West style. Made no statements oh. as he went about his business. Oh, yeah. Publicly, Money. it seemed as though Money. he was. <laughs> <laughs> hey, he's back. That's really cool that they're parodying Rambo and he's in this movie. If Edwards gets wind of this, he'll use it against you in the campaign. He'll try to prove that you're incompetent. I can prove that as well as he can. <laughs> gotcha. Let's go get the door, huh? Uh, well, Walters, looks like we've got our saboteur. That's your wife, sir. <laughs> Dude, cheat on her so damn much, he don't remember his wife. <laughs> Look like the dude from Mortal Kombat. Yeah, that dude is in great shape. I never knew Charlie Sheen got in great shape like that. That dude looks good, man. Oh, 
I can see how he became a heartthrob then. Especially with that hairstyle too. Damn, that girl fine as hell to the left. Yeah, he won. I tried to do something like that when I was younger. Bust my ass. So is this a parody of Rambo right here? Or is this a parody of that John claude Van Damme movie? Ah, ew. No, 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 no. Wait, 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 wait. Yo, there's so much going on in this movie, man. What, did he fight him with the force? What the hell was that? Ooh, okay. <laughs> Golly. <laughs> you win. Yeah, whoever did the wardrobe, they got her right. Mm. <laughs> Come on, monk. Stay by your virtue, bro. Colonel, who are they? She's CIA. The other man's an extra. <laughs> Boy's not gonna get any piece of dialogue. <laughs> this is Michelle Huddleston. Topper Harley. Help. Now we have to go in to get the men who went in to get the men who went in to get the men. My job is to make sure we don't fail again. <laughs> I'm going this time. We want you to go with him, Topper. Why me, ma'am? Because you're the best of what's left. I mean, well, it was an ambush almost every single time, I'm guessing. So I think the colonel right here, or whoever that is, I think he probably is the snitch. They trying they hardest to make it seem like this girl is fine as hell, bro. But I mean, like, they haven't seen a woman in years, like he said, so they can have a crackhead right there and them <laughs> be like, oh, damn, she's fine. When are you going to put Ramada behind you? What are you talking about? You say you're a war. Are you serious? <laughs> Doesn't that go against your belief, sir? You've come an awful long way to bring me a lecture, haven't you, Colonel? I know you were hurt. Oh, right, I see you, boy. Trying to tap dance in the guts, bro. Sorry, it's got to end for me sometime. If you should change your mind, here's my 900 number. It's five dollars a minute. I'll waive the charge. <laughs> I did that w once when I was a kid. I didn't know what it was. Oh snap! She's in here. Yes, her fine self. Is that supposed to be Michael, bro? <laughs> Yo, Michael about to shoot these dudes and then he gonna shoot his girl on accident. Say that you're my sweetheart, my love. Damn, she was... Ooh, it's a wet kiss right there. I like that shit. It's always nice to see how popular and legendary a movie will become and you see so many other movies reference that movie. I've never seen Lady in the Tramp, but I do know about this scene though, yeah. Kiss me. Kiss me like you've never yeah, didn't they do that in the last movie? Hey, I thought we was gonna see Michael do the shooting, bro. <laughs> yeah. Man, he looks so different without that damn hat. Phil! <laughs> we didn't have any other hats, bro. I had to use this towel right here. <laughs> Sign the document. Ew. What's up with the gross humor? I don't know why a lot of movies be doing that. To stop your vicious imperialistic tactics. <laughs> I still think that he's a part of this whole thing. This is like just a setup. But at the same time, why would they show that scene of him getting tortured? To these United States. Ew. Oh my God. Along. He's gonna throw up on his nuts. Yeah. Huh. Working. Filthy. And so I would like to. My God, this is so gross, man. To harmony with our planet and world prospect. Oh, oh my God. 
<laughs> Look like a freaking monster. Looking for a place to sit, Lieutenant? Uh, I mean, you can have a place to sit. You know, my face. Don't go around calling yourself the president. I wouldn't do that, and I don't think you should either. It just doesn't hold water. Uh, for that matter, neither do I. Just get away from these power cables, huh? What started this whole trend with these type of comedies where they'll have somebody in power be a dumbass, bro? Like, it is hilarious. Let's go to my apartment and discuss our mission. I'm putty in your hands. In my hands, nothing turns to putty. Oh yeah, it gets hard. I get it. That's that's fire. That's some nice dialogue right there. Man, can you focus on the road, sir? Man, not be beating your meat looking back here. Sir, please focus on the road. <laughs> yeah, you can do that. Just please focus on the road. Lightsaber sounds. So she got lightsaber titties. <laughs> the boy watching it 3D. Yeah, this dude is a pervert. I don't know if I trust somebody enough to do something like this to me. Oh, yes, please. Thank you. Fix that. Sir. Shoot, I'm all over the internet now, man. That black dude was recording me in every single angle. Dude, making multiple copies right now. Look, I told myself last night was just going to be last night. I guess I just never counted on finding a guy so deep, so sensitive. Shoot, yeah, that boy was definitely deep, man. That dude was balls deep, man. He, yeah, he was sensitive. Boy, it came in like two seconds later. <laughs> it's a little toy helicopter. That's funny. Rabinowitz, demolition. Hey, this dude is hilarious, bro. Whose line is it anyway? I love that show. This is the first time I've ever seen him in a movie. This is the prison camp area. It is heavily fortified, but they'll never expect it. A rock in a hard place. Oh my God, bro. Stop it. Get some help. When you go into battle, I'd like you to take something of mine with you. I knew that was fake. And I don't know why she over here forcing this damn seductive voice, bro. I'm just not into her. And I know there's probably some people that be like, what? That girl fine as hell. Bro, everybody's different. He already black. He don't need it, bro. You gonna make him midnight black? <laughs> Painted a sky king. No parents in sight. Party is on. Green, 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 Hook up. Green, green, green. <laughs> I wonder how red sounds. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder if this is the same guy from earlier in the movie. It'd be crazy if it's his chick. Stop it. It is. Oh, damn. You whooped my ass. You knew it was me. It was, uh, it was a gift. It's all very touching, but this is no time to reminisce. I'm happy you took that shit off. I hate fake beauty marks, man. The meat smoking. Shut up. No, no, no. Let's take it off the grill. Uh, leave me alone, would you? Frank, you're drunk again. <laughs> oh, yeah, whose fault is that? This one hell of a shortcut, man. I would have got me a burger. We get up at, at five. At first, I thought they'd handed me the wrong dossier. I couldn't believe they wanted this man dead. I knew they was going to do Apocalypse Now. I just knew it, bro. I, I... Hey, what's up, Dad? I loved you in Wall Street. I just, I knew, I had a feeling they were gonna do an Apocalypse Now reference, bro. I'm also hoping if they're gonna do a uh, platoon reference, unless they already did that in the first movie. I thought I was never going to see you again, that you were out of my life, but it's a sequel, I had to come. <laughs> do you have any idea what the critics will say? Same warmed over character. I mean, but they love these characters. I'm happy to see all these people back. If I was joking, I would say a horse walks into a bar, the bartender says, why the long face? I mean, that's a, you are Mary. Basic ass joke, man. I thought he was gonna say something actually funny. That's a fine ass man with a mustache. 
<laughs> like I said, man, we're ignorant fishermen. I was about to say, man, if you don't get your Rambo gun, jalapeno, what? There we go! Rambo! Please don't tell me it's that damn mole. How do you find that in the dirt? <laughs> Nobel Prize for inventing the artificial appendix. Exactly. Dexter is one of the captives. He's my husband. You've got to Oh, I gotta kill him. I appreciate you telling me his name and everything. A rabbi, a priest, and a minister walk. Man, nobody ain't trying to hear them corny ass jokes, bruh. What was the point of wasting my time right there, man? I'm trying to get this mission done. That boy said, no, not a tie. Now I'm civilized. Yo, I want that knife. That knife can do any and everything. <laughs> I would have tried to put it back on the base. Get out of here. Damn, that's a waste of a good banana right there. <laughs> Please tell me he's gonna shoot the freaking chicken. Yes! <laughs> that probably was the best thing I've seen throughout this whole movie. Are you f kidding me? Seriously, you tell me you can get out of there? <laughs> and it's just freaking sticks anyway, bro. Just break it. <laughs> this is a cute little sneeze. Look like something from Spy Kids. Once the movie gets to a point where it's like really stupid, then that's when I kind of just stop finding it funny. But it just it starts to become entertaining, you know? Like pretty much, I'm starting to feel a little bit the same way about this one like I did the first one. Even though I feel like I laughed a little bit more with this one than the first one. So now it's like a video game. Oh, for real? Then you saying Robocop better than Rambo? Total Recall, I've never seen that. Oh, you talking about like body counts in the movies. Oh. That doesn't even look like a wall. That looked like it might be a counter or something. I knew it, bro. Damn. Drop the gun. <laughs> What? Why would I do that? I have a bigger gun than you that has a you faster fire rate. <laughs> Man, I just know movies like this, they be having such a good time. I don't. Ah. Ah. Yes, please die. Go on about your business, son. I've got a bone to settle with this guy. Yes, sir. I'll get Dexter. Let's make this a fair fight. Are you actually gonna do something productive or just be a dumb? Whoa, are you serious? Oh, that is so cool that they did something like this. Go ahead. Hey, Mr. Bean. Y'all look like y'all related. Y'all don't look like I should be married. Teddy, look. Shoot, I know I, I get the same comments whenever I watch certain movies like this and I don't like laugh at every single joke. It would just be a whole bunch of people talking about, man, you got to turn your brain off. But there's only so much that I could do when it comes to turning my brain off, bro. I'm not a full on moron, bro. <laughs> I just can't have my brain go completely dead. Turn your back on America. Oof, because of your own petty jealousy. You're going to pay for this. I don't like her anymore. She's the villain because you got a husband and you just cheated on your husband. <laughs> Oh 
my god. Yeah, I knew that breath stink. You better freaking uh, put out that damn fireplace. Is this the exact same scene from Terminator? Dexter? Damn, you gonna give him the best friend hug? I wanna meet your parents and pet your dog. My parents are dead, Topper. My dog hates them. Wow. Can I pet your cat? Goodbye, Topper. God bless you. Wait a second. Let me get a shot of you two. It'll be a great visual for the talk shows. <laughs> So this whole time you could have uh, hopped your ass on somewhere? Your arm around her. I've almost got it. This is a great shot. My god, you're gonna Oh, so that dude's a cut. You know, under other circumstances, you'd make a great couple. H E You're moving too much. Quit spinning. This will make me rich and <laughs> <laughs> I mean, he's still alive though, because this is a comedy, right? The <laughs> boy Hussein looked like he need to be in the Broadway play Cats. We're too heavy. We need to lose some weight. Then get your fat ass off, bro. Ah, the Wizard of Oz reference. That's cool. Yeah, so this is pretty much like watching a live action cartoon. Ha, <laughs> I like that. They went behind the sun. Never seen that before. All right, everybody, there we go. I finally watched it, man. And um, it kind of went exactly how I thought it would go. It was an entertaining movie, just like the last one. Uh, it has some great jokes, you know, some good laughs, some good dialogue. I love the cast, man. You can tell they was having a great time. I really hope that y'all enjoyed watching this movie with me. You know, please like the video, share, comment down below, subscribe. Click the bell so you know when I upload more videos and follow me on all my social medias. Links will be down in the description below. Okay, everybody, there we go with Hot Shots part Oh, man, and I know that there's probably gonna be a few people that's gonna feel a certain type of way. Just wanna let you know that I'm sorry that I didn't love this movie as much as you did. This movie, like I said, has some great jokes. I love the cast, but I still laughed more than the first one. I, I can definitely tell you that. I mean, but it's been a long time since I, since I seen the first one. I was just like, okay, yeah, I see what they're doing right here, but it's just like, it's not funny to me because I'm just like, it's it's too stupid. And it's, like, it's just like, it's too random. And I know people was like oh well you gotta turn your brain off like there's only so much that some people can take like you can probably turn your brain off with throughout the whole movie me i can turn my brain off to a certain point and then after that i'm just like okay this shit right here is starting to get ridiculous i would actually go ahead and give this movie either a c plus or a b minus i think that's probably a perfect grade for it man if you like to see my full length reactions to this movie any of the other movies i do tv shows i do you can click the link down in the description to my patreon i can't wait to see what other movies y'all want me to check out you know go ahead message me on instagram or go message me on patreon but with all that being said i'll see you on the next one all right peace